Assess the hips one at a time using two maneuvers. In the Barlow maneuver, first adduct the hip by bringing the thigh toward the midline. Then apply a gentle posterior pressure to the knee. In the Ortolani maneuver, flex the infant's knees to a 90 degree position. Then abduct the legs by folding the thigh outwards. Hips and I want to look for symmetric hip abduction, that's abduction of the bilateral hips. And you can see on her, both of her hips abduct the same amount. And then I bring them both up together and I do the Galeazzi test. And I'm looking for knee height. And you can see how the right knee is a little bit lower than the left knee here, which suggests that this hip might be dislocated. And then again, I'll bring them into abduction. And then I'll do my Ortolani and my Barlow test. So on this hip here, the left hip, I'm holding the knee and I'm gonna br and I'm gonna examine one hip at a time, and I'm gonna bring the left hip into adduction, adduction, and give it some posterior stress to see if I can move it out of the hip socket. And that would be a Barlow exam. And that was a negative Barlow exam. And then the Ortolani exam is the opposite, where I abduct it and I lift up on the trochanter to see if I can put a dislocated hip back into the socket. And this is a negative Ortolani exam. And so now I'm going to do the same exam maneuver on the right hip, where I'm going to do a Barlow test. So I'm going to adduct it. And there, it dislocated out the back. So that's a positive Barlow exam. And then the Ortolani is the opposite, where I lift it up and it pops back in. So positive Barlow out, positive Ortolani in. Barlow out, Ortolani in. And you can see how it's not uncomfortable for her. It doesn't cause her any pain. And those are the best.